Hello, my name is Tom McPherson and welcome to my new Circle Line Art School video, How to Draw in Five Point Perspective. This is a drawing based on Times Square in New York. I will add some colour with some pencils and pens towards the end of the drawing. The first step is to draw a horizontal line in the middle of the page and then the vertical line in the middle of this horizontal line. Next, draw a mark or a cross at the end of each of these lines and then one more cross in the middle. Now we can draw a curved line between the two horizontal vanishing points to find the baseline of a building. Next, mark a dot on this baseline towards the right and then we can draw a vertical curved line through this dot using the two vertical vanishing points. We will use this to make one of the edges of the first building. Next, add another vertical curve to the right of this first curved line and this will be the right hand edge of the building. And then we can draw a horizontal curve and this will be the top of the building as it would look distorted in five point perspective. In five point perspective we're really looking up and down and straight ahead and left and right all at the same time. It's like a wide angle lens that things towards the edge of the picture should look distorted. I will darken these lines so that you can see how far we've got in drawing this side of the building. Now we can add the fifth central vanishing point and draw two straight lines to make the left hand side of the building. If we now draw one more vertical curve, we have completed our first building in five point perspective. I will make the lines darker and add a long wall going towards the centre vanishing point and then I'll draw a second building a little bit further away using exactly the same technique as the first building. Now to draw a fin building in the centre of this image, I will just have to distort the vertical lines going to the left and going to the right and then the top and the bottom line of the building will again be slightly curved. And now I can draw a building on the left using the curved vertical lines and curved horizontal lines that I used on the right hand side. Adding straight lines that go towards the center vanishing point as that's our central point we're looking at. In five point perspective the guidelines will make a pattern a bit like an onion cut in half. I'll speed this drawing up now so that you can see how the drawing develops over time.
I will now add some pen lines over all the buildings and then darken the sky with a black pen and add some colour with some coloured pencils for the bright lights of Times Square and I'll also draw some long lines to represent the cartel lights. I can draw some people in too, just little blobs that get smaller as they get further away from the front of the picture. Thank you very much for watching this art tutorial on Five Point Perspective. I hope you like it and find it useful for your own drawings. Please subscribe to my free YouTube channel, Circle Line Art School, where you can see over 200 of my other drawings, and I post a new drawing every week. Keep drawing and see you next time.